great. A pallet of materials have just arrived on the second floor via the lift. An hour of warehouse staff is now transporting it to the picking area at the front of the pallet storage area using a forklift. So, let's take a look at the specific working process of this smart warehouse. These are the conveyor systems at the front end of the pallet storage aisles. They correspond to 16 inbound and outbound gates on the second floor, with another 16 on the first floor. So there is also the AGV system at the front end of the pallet storage aisles, featuring 36 latent robots, 11 on the second floor and 25 on the first floor. And now we can see the warehouse staff picking materials, labeling them with printed text to assign them identity information, and then choosing the appropriate carrier and storage location based on the size and weight specifications of the materials. And based on the principle of maximizing shelf space utilization, the intelligent warehouse system prioritizes replenishment. The stack of grain removes a partially filled pallet and transports it to the front end of the pallet storage aisle where a latent AGV robot then takes it to the picking area for the staff to store the materials in the pallet. And here's some interesting fact. The stack crane can be considered the leading actor in the intelligent warehouse system. They move up and down the shelves, responsible for placing materials in the correct positions or retrieving them from designated locations. And then the supporting actor is who? Is the latent AGV robot. These are small and agile but incredibly powerful, capable of carrying up to 1,000 kilometers. They play a crucial role in the short distance transportation between the front end of the pallet storage aisle and the picking area. And once the warehouse staff has finished picking the goods, the latent AGV robot precisely transports the materials to the front end of the pallet storage aisle where the stack of crane then moves the materials to the designated shell position within the system. However, you might have noticed these frame-like structures here that resemble those photo-taking frames at the outdoor tourist spots, right? So what are these for? These are shape detection devices that can determine if the length, the width, and the height of the goods exceed the design specifications. If the dimensions are exceeded, the staff will make adjustments. The manual picking area workstation also has an online weighing function. If the weight exceeds the limit, the system will trigger an alarm and a material pallet will be returned. And once the staff has made the necessary adjustments, the system will allow it to be transported to the storage location by the stack of grain. So this ensures the safe and efficient operation of the warehouse system. Over here is the bin storage section. The conveyor system at the front end of the bin storage aisles is different from the pallet storage area. It uses a roller conveyor to transport the material bins connecting the picking area to the bin storage area. The workflow here is similar to the pallet storage area. We can also see many screens here displaying real-time information about material identities, warehouse system status, and other details. The second floor serves as the main storage area of the intelligent warehouse, handling the storage of the various components and the materials needed for our pharmaceutical equipment. When the intelligent warehouse receives a material retrieval command from the system, the stacker crane retrieves the materials from the designated storage position and using Latin AGV robots or roller conveyors and transports them to the picking area where the staff picks them out. The AGV then transports them to the corresponding workstation in the workshop or even through an unmanned vehicle for cross-workshop transportation. What we can see is just the tip of the iceberg and behind the scenes there are WMS, and WCS and other software control systems and as well as various supporting facilities like charging stations for the robots. The engineers in Trugin Technologies Intelligent Warehousing and the Logistics Technology Department have built this warehouse, bringing immense convenience to our colleagues in the production and the manufacturing departments responsible for warehousing. 
。医药装备上的零部件非常多，如何实现快速精准的存入仓库，特别是快速精准的从仓库领取出来，高效的交给生产制造的同事。这对企业的制造交付影响非常大。像一楼的托盘主出库区，一个小时就可以实现三百个托盘的出入库，料箱库的数量则更大。这个效率是传统仓库无法比拟的。智能仓库为楚天科技的完美交付提供了强大的保障。The powerful manufacturing and the delivery capabilities create value for customers in the pharmaceutical industry. Of course. This intelligent warehouse is just one aspect, and we invite you to visit Trukin Technologies headquarters in China, and we are confident you won't be disappointed.